Hello again, this is Robert Veach here, and this is my video review of the Amazon Basic Wireless Remote Control for Canon DSLR cameras. Now this comes with a one year warranty and comes with this nifty little holder right here that you could pull the string and adjust the tension on the top of it and it holds this unit nicely right inside. On the unit, it's very basic. It has a one button switch right there, you can hear. And if you look at the front of the unit, it has an infrared transmitter, just like the remote for your DVRs. And the battery is simple to install and replace. You push that little clip right there and it comes out. And I mark the positive on that side so that I know the polarity. And I also put white there so I know that it matches this side. You might want to do the same thing. Now a little tip with these, all these type of units. If you're not using it for a while, don't completely put it in. Leave about an eighth of an inch gap there. And what that'll do, that'll render it so that it's not working. And some of these units trickle energy away from the battery. So you go to use it and the battery's dead. By doing that little drawer opening right there, about eighth of an inch, that won't happen. Then when you're ready to use it, just push it in like that. And that'll save you a lot of hassles of changing the battery. Now the range of this unit is uh, listed in two different ways. It says 10 foot on one place on the listing, and then it says 16 feet on another place. Well, it turns out that I did get 17 feet range with my camera. So I'm gonna go with the 16 foot range that Amazon says. Um, I got a full 17 feet, which was really nice. So I'm gonna show how to set this up in the camera. I have a Canon T2i 550D, and I'm gonna demonstrate how it works for recording video and also for pictures. When you're in the picture mode, this is the P setting. I'm in the one shot mode and you can see that the timer is enabled and you can see a little remote control symbol right there. And once you set that to the correct mode, then the remote control will work on your Canon camera. So on my TX1, if you hit the menu button, you see a remote control right there and you have it enable or disable. So just make sure you have it set to enable. Now the infrared sensor on the Canon T2i 550D is located right here, right below the shutter. So that's what you're gonna be pointing to that's gonna pick up the infrared from the remote. So the basic operation in picture mode, here is the remote, I'm pointing it towards the camera. You see it auto focuses and it takes the picture after a certain amount of delay time. I'm in video mode right now on the camera and same thing I can hit that and you saw it blink and now if you look at the back of the camera it is recording right there now if you push the button again it blinked and it stopped recording at that point so what do I think about the Amazon basic wireless remote control for Canon DSLR cameras? Well, I like this unit. Um, Amazon basics always impresses me with their price point and it has a full one year warranty and it worked just great. So it's very inexpensive product, but yet it's pretty versatile for you to use with your DSLR. So I'm gonna give this product a full five star rating on my channel. Please remember to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon so you're alerted to new video uploads. If you like this video, please hit the like button also. I hope this video review helped you with your buying decisions. Thanks for watching.